Good morning, 47. The board has sanctioned Eric Soda's for termination. After Colorado, we did some digging into Soda's private affairs and discovered that he has been fast-tracked for critical heart surgery at the hyper-exclusive Gama Private Hospital in Hokkaido, Japan. Such a display of power has Providence written all over it. Soda's, who suffers from a rare condition known as situs inversus, where his internal organs are reversed, desperately needs a right-sided heart transplant and has clearly betrayed the ICA to get it. He was admitted last night and is currently being prepped for a three-day surgery. We have booked you into Gama under the usual guise of Tobias Reaper, corporate shark, here for a standard medical checkup. As such, you will need to play it by ear and procure whatever tools you need to complete the mission. You also need to eliminate Yuki Yamazaki, a Tokyo lawyer who works for Providence. Sodas has already given Yamazaki access to our client records and has agreed to provide a full list of active ICA operatives post-operation. This transaction cannot be allowed to happen. Sodas must pay for his treachery and his insidious employers must be taught a lesson. ICA's sovereignty is at stake. Powerful as Providence may be, we need to draw a line in the sand. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Hokkaido 47. The Gama Private Hospital provides cutting edge medical treatment for the global elite outside the law if required. The facility is partially run by an artificial intelligence system known as Kai. The AI oversees patient admission to various areas in the hospital and even participates in some medical procedures. You will find Eric Soders in the operating theater, undergoing a pre-surgery regenerative stem cell treatment, a highly controversial procedure yet to be approved by Japanese authorities. Yuki Yamazaki has already arrived. You'll find her in her suite or roaming the restaurant and spa areas of the hospital. Soders is scheduled to be put under soon. Let us make sure he stays that way. Good luck, 47. Well, here I am, taking a nap. I mean, not really, I'm like, w I'm wide awake, but I'm just laying down. Hmm. All right, well, let's get up. Hello. As part of the service here at Gamma, your personal robe has been outfitted with a radio frequency identification chip. Crap. The device will unlock They're on to me. <laughs> oh, never mind. I, uh, yeah, so... This is the final mission. So, I guess we can start examining already, doing stuff. But that means you can't sneak anything into this place because it's super highly secure, so you actually have to start off with nothing. This is a closet. This is not a room. So, you, there are some things you can start getting... I mean, this is just examining. This isn't... Okay, so I think there's something in here, at least. Let's see. So, yeah, there, there's mine. There's some scissors, so you can get some weapons, but I'm looking for more of a non-lethal weapon. That's just not it. Watch this. I'm going to tamper with my own toilet control panel. I mean, why is that an illegal action? It's my own toilet, ain't it? <laughs> Oh my, the Japanese, they have the toilets of the century. Wow. Anyway, so, we gotta kill... Where, where are the targets? <laughs> hey, where are the targets? Okay, Eric Solders, the ICA, the spy from Providence, who is in the ICA. Why are you... Oh... Secret operative of Providence, I see. Oh, all right. So, there are a few mission stories that, as you can see, I've done these two mission stories, so I'm going to do, of course, some ones that I haven't done yet. So, we can do Ghost in the Machine, which seems like it's going to deal with this entire system. So, I kind of want to do that. Well, looks like there's a few others, so... Let's do Ghost of the Machine, because that seems really interesting. Oh my, there's a thing right up there. Let's go... 
Let's go see what's up here. I am. Yeah, Helmet Kruger, hey! That's pretty much who I am. Take a look at me! I'm Helmet Kruger! Look at me. <laughs> he thought I was Helmet Kruger. Uh, can I help you? You're kind of inside my personal space. You don't have any personal space, woman. Alright, I've already done that on uh, Mission Story, that one there. Anyway, let, let's focus back on the mission. Uh, seaweed therapy is this way, right? Crap. I gotta get in there. Uh-oh. What are you doing here? I'm... I'm in here. To follow me. Are we clear? Yes. We're clear. Go down! Okay, hey, listen. Don't shoot any guns. Listen. Stay down. You stay down. And you stay down, okay? I don't need to raise any security that we don't need to raise, alright? You guys need to calm down, and everything will be just fine. Alright, so what do we have here? We have some system manual that I have to look at. Alright, let's see what this is. So, the building AI known as Kai not only keeps the building running, but it also controls the surgery robot in the operating theater. That's where Sodas is at the moment. The manual states that the AI will automatically revive any flatlined patient which could prove to be a problem. Ah, but the hospital director does have access to the mainframe. Care to run a hospital, 47? I get to run the entire hospital. Okay. Well, first, so it's not suspicious when I walk out and that I have a gun. There. Now I can go to some... Ooh. Ooh. Hmm. I gotta get him... But he's right there, and he can notice me that I'm fake. The oh, who's the Amazon Kahuna Huna? To the Yakuza, Where? The <gasps> I see you. I'm not suspicious at all. Look at me. Well, this absolute a hole right there. He keeps just standing in the middle here and going up places that you can't get to the sky. So I don't know how you expect the game expects me to get it. So I'm just gonna go for another one. He had a picture of the crazy lady on. It's called no smoking so I'm assuming we're gonna we're gonna pull another prank you remember last time we put a we put a blunt in that guy's cigarette pack this time we're gonna put a bomb I hope at least that would be a very epic prank if you know what I mean that's that's what we call a prank of I was gonna say the century but we'll say the decade because you a hundred years that's a pretty that's a lot to say of the entire century so we'll say the decade what are we talking about guys Oh <gasps> uh, yeah, yeah, that was me five years ago. What? You smoked? Hey, oh, you're lucky I didn't push you off just right there and now. In a place like this. Good luck. Uh, All right, let's see what we got. Yuki dropped her cigarettes off the lift when arriving at the hospital. Hmm. According to her bodyguards, this has put her on edge. <laughs> Maybe you can help quench those cravings, forty-seven. Cigarettes are contraband at Gamma, but surely not everyone follows the rules. Oh, wouldn't you know that? Not everyone follows the rules. That's... We know that. Alright, so it looks... Search the Texans room for cigarettes. The Texans? What do you got against Texas? What did they ever do to you? Security detail yes, it's me! Oh, there's a new mission story? What's this? Gama has banned the serving of fugu following an incident where a guest was poisoned by a poorly carved piece of the poisonous fish. Oh! It appears, however, that Yuki Yamazaki is trying to sway the chef to slice up his final specimen and serve it to her. Ha ha ha! Who are we to deny her such pleasure, 47? Oh! Who are we? You are right. I found... Yeah, this sounds much more fun than... No, actually, you know what? This is much less fun than putting explosive in her cigarettes. Let's just be honest here. Alright, so I gotta find the f the fugo fish in here, huh? Is this it? No, this is a frying pan. I gotta find the fish. Where in the world is a fugu f fish? Fish? Hey, have you seen any fish? Nope. Alright. Looking for fish. Looking for fish. We're looking for fish. We're looking for fish. It's in here somewhere. We're looking for fish. We're looking for fish. Ooh, oh, 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 no. No. We'll put that in the fish. We'll cut, 
We'll give her the whole fish. We won't cut it up. We'll keep the poisonous parts in the fish. We'll add poison to the poison. We'll double the poison. Where the hell is this fish? This is not a big kitchen. Where is it? Oh, hey, here it is. So I'm just gonna... Yeah. Ooh. Yes. Yes. Wait, there's a chef's disguise right here. I don't need to go in there. I am a chef. I will now serve this dish. Poison the sushi. Poison the sushi. I am a chef. Beware, everybody. I am the most dangerous chef you will ever meet. The chef of chefness. If you know what I'm talking about, which you don't. I am a chef, yes. <laughs> yes. Well, I mean, I could do this either way, but let's just let's do it how it's actually supposed to be. Yes, uh, prepare the sushi. Yeah, right, forty-seven. Let's make sure this is her last meal. Oh uh, yeah, where is she actually? Is that her right there, or? Yeah, yep, that that's definitely her coming along. Oh uh, yes, <laughs> yes, this is my meal. This is my sushi. <laughs> Look at me, hands behind my back. Yeah. I am reserving the sushi for one very special person, and none of you get it. Oh, she's coming. Oh, she's right there. I am so ready to Hey! This isn't what is wrong with you. Hey, where'd you come from? Oh my god, some supernatural crap is going on here. I assure you, my lips are sealed. Ah! No, no, no! Would you like to try out delicious sushi? Yes. Freshly prepared, of course. Yeah. Uh, is this fugu? <gasps> I knew you would come yes. out eventually. Good for you. You're I welcome. You like My colleague is a straight arrow. Mm -hmm. Me, I say it's good to live dangerously. Oh, yes, it is. That's right out of my mouth. Oh, yes. mm, that's exactly right. Mm -hmm. Smooth, velvet softness. Yeah. Absolutely delicious. Yes! My compliments to the chef. Yes! I am a genius. Now what's gonna happen? Oh! Yes! Yes! Target down. I now it's did it. To now we can kill the other guy. Alright, new mission story, everyone. Also known as the curator, the curator is participating in some sort of medical trial. Interesting. Interesting. The curator oversees the hospital's organ storage facility and surely has access to Soda's donor heart. <gasps> I suggest you locate the research assistant's report 47 and find out what this neural implant is for. Could prove useful. Yes. I forgot. I can't be here. Wait. Hold on. You don't see me. All right. Let's check the. For the assistant's journal. Oh. Yeah, don't mind me. Just, you know, knocking people off when they're not looking. But you know, other other than that, you know, it's all good. I had to stir this. Nobody saw that, right? Alright, first of all, we're gonna destroy this evidence like a pure genius. Now nobody knows. Ooh. Hmm. <laughs> Ooh, I'm just gonna take that. No way. Search the sleeping quarters for the neurochip remote. All right, for the the neurochip in Eric Solder's head. Yeah, his mood controlling chip, which I don't think it said that in the little mission story briefing, but that that's what it was. No, I'm not gonna enter that. I'm gonna. Wait, no, I don't want to go this way. I want to go this way. God, I can't pay attention to anywhere I'm going. So it should be in here. Hmm. Mm -hmm -hmm. I'm just gonna... I have it now. Use the remote to increase dosage. Is this... Is this gonna just be like a super easy kill? I just have to get near and press this button and then it's over just like that? Because otherwise this mission would be much easier than... It, it usually is because of these two stories. All right, I gotta see this for myself in person. Come on, <laughs> let's check this out. Oh. Oh wait, that guy. 
to be here as a student what's is a life all right let's try this oh, oh. My. This oh my god <laughs> he's high it's beautiful. It's, my god he makes some high to be a place for everything and everything in its proper place <laughs> my god why haven't I noticed before you're so happy my babies. Oh my, my baby. Where are you going? My god. It's like then I decrease it and then he, he just... She just gets so depressed. He's like, I was that so happy. Right oh. Uh oh, uh, don't! This is what he sold out the ICA for. My god, actually it did not kill him. The world now, oh! Let's see where this takes him, shall we? Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh my god, what's gonna happen? I have no idea what's going on, just so you guys know. Oh wait, he's alone. Unless you can see me. No, they can't. I can get him. <laughs> I think that's what I gotta do. Alright. What are you up to? Is that the heart? What if I do this? Uh oh. He's depressed now. Depression. Increased. Oh. I think he's gonna die if I keep doing this. And if I do this again. Oh ho ho. Do it again. Yep. <laughs> How do I. Do I smell flowers? Alright, yeah, this is just funny, just going back and forth like this. Is anything actually gonna happen if I just keep doing this over and over? Yeah, I don't think anything's gonna actually happen, so I think I just gotta take him down. I think that's that was the goal here all along. And now I open this. And now I destroy the heart. God, the blood's on the wall. <laughs> oh my god. I did it! I mean, he's technically... He's not dead yet, but... He really is dead. Oh my god. That was... Awesome. I am gonna get out of here now. Oh, I'm gonna use the gondola. The super futuristic gondola. Oh, that's gonna be interesting. Before I go, here, you guys can, can, um, you can have this. Why, why can't I drop this? Well, wait, why, why can't I, I, I have a kitchen knife. Look, it's kitchen knives. Look, guys, kitchen knives. All right. I'm right with the blood all over my robe or whatever that is. And that is actually a really cool looking gondola, I'm not gonna lie, that's, that's really cool, that, that's, that's like awesome, futurist. Oh my god, I barely made it to 82, like that is such a close sliver of a margin, like oh my god, that was insanely close there. Miss Burnwood. That's not what my ticket says. We received your message. Loud and clear, I might add. Honestly, you could have just sacked the poor guy. I didn't catch your name. No, you didn't. There'll be no retaliation, not for Soders, nor any other recent fiascos. Someone's been meddling in our affairs, killing our operatives, and making the ICA look like fools. I think you got close to that someone, closer than we've ever been. That's why we're hiring you to take him down. I don't think so. 
Don't rattle our cages, Miss Burnwood. You really have no idea. You spy on us, bribe our people, and you have the gall to demand our help. No. You can't be trusted. Even so, we've been around for a long, long time. I think we could help each other. Some 20 years ago, your agency took in a young man with no past and extraordinary skills. In his own special way, he cares about you and vice versa. And ever since that time, you've never stopped wondering where he came from and who made him what he is. There was a doctor, some depraved experiment, but he's gone now. Ah. Well, if you believe the questions died with him, we have nothing further to discuss. If not, as I said, I think we could help each other. Partners, then. Cheer up, Miss Burnwood. We... <laughs> we are the lesser evil. This terrorist. He wants nothing but chaos. He's only a terrorist if you win. Miss Burnwood, we won a long time ago. This... <laughs> this is maintenance. And that is the entire Hitman 1 story. And as you can see here, go straight into the Hitman 2 first mission. So, wow. That was pretty cool to go back, rewatch all the cutscenes, remind myself of the story before getting to Hitman 3. That's important to remember the story. To be honest, I don't remember what most of the people were. I just know they were evil people. So... I just like way missions assassinate people whatever way possible. So now all there's left is those pretty sure there's another two bonus missions and then there's a couple seasonal content missions as well. So I'll be sure to get to those and then we're on to Hitman 3. Thank you all for watching. Get this video like game. Go subscribe for much more. Comments I don't ignore and post notifications.